Hey everybody, it's me, Henry, and welcome to my channel. Today in this video, we're gonna continue to talk about the book, The Way of Life by Mr. Kazuo in the Mori. The first chapter, Making Your Dreams Come True, section number seven and number eight. And section number seven, we're gonna talk about perseverance is the key to succeed. If you want to achieve something you've never done before, first thing first, you need to believe your possibility. And a possibility here is referring to your future ability. If you judge yourself based on your current ability to decide whether you can make it or not, well, forever, you can't do something new to or to overcome the problem. So you have to believe your own possibility and set a higher target, which is beyond your current ability and fight for it. So what you need to do now is to light up your dream and burn it just like the eternal flame, nonstop, continuously to burn it. So this is the way how you're gonna increase your performance to increase the bar. During the first time Kyocera received a big honor from IBM people, they were so happy, but things happen. The requirements from IBM, that were so hard. Unbelievable, it's hard to make it. So usually this package is just one page of length, but from IBM, the specification requirement is thick like a book. It was so hard to achieve. They tried many times, but failed. In the end, they thought they make it according to the specs, but eventually rejected by IBM. Return all the products back to Kyocera. So to be frank, the requirement from IBM that was not easy. If you talk about difficulty level, it was like few more levels than previous customers until they didn't have the precision tool to measure the product. And Mr. Inmori was thinking for so many times, perhaps with their current technology level, they couldn't really make it. But for a small company just like Kisora during that time, that was a great opportunity. And in front of the discouraged employee, and after that incident, Mr. Inmori told them to do whatever it takes, do all your best, try your best to make it happen. But still, it didn't turn out well. He had no idea at all, sitting in front of the ceramic boiler, looking at his technician, and he asked, did you pray to the God? Did you try your best? If yes, the rest would just leave it to fate. Actually, he was trying to ask, have you done all you can? And after so many tries, eventually, they fulfill the standard. They make it. They produce the brand new product. Within two years time, the company was fully loaded, received big orders and shipped out all the goods to the clients. And until the last drop, when Mr. Inamori was looking at the last drop food of the products, shipping out from the companies, and he felt so touched. And he was thinking the power of human is so huge, it's unlimited. When you look at the goal that seems like the impossible to you, as long as you are passionate about it, focus on it, it is possible you can make it because from the process you have already raised the bar, raised your performance, your ability. It seems like you have unleashed the unlimited potential. So no matter how hard is your goal, you need to judge it based on the future ability. So with this, you're gonna make it and you can unleash your unlimited potential. Just a matter of moment when you're gonna wake up your potential. And during that time, Mr. Inamori always took out the big projects which were beyond their core standard. So it seems like a little bit reckless to him during that time to take up all this big project. But this is the way how he managed business. Since from the beginning, he always took up the big projects which were rejected by the big companies, the big factory. So he said, if you don't do this for a small company just like Kyocera during that time, you can't even take up any project. But of course, Mr. Inamori didn't put the big hope to take up all the high technology projects, but at least he won't say I can make it or in the gray area, maybe I can make it. He will always say, I can make it. So this is the way how he took up the big project. And after every time he took out the big projects back to the factory, his employees were shocked because that was beyond their ability. And Mr. Inamori will always educate the employees. We can make it with the passion and motivated his employee. So they get motivated. They're ready to take up all the challenges. So things are not that easy as we thought. 
And every time they face the obstacle, difficulty, Mr. In the morning will always motivate employees. Well, when we think that we can't make it anymore, we exhaust this. All this are just part of the process and we can make it. When we talk about taking up the big projects, which is beyond the ability, it sounds like a bit cheating, like you can't make it, but you say you can make it. Well, look at this way. You start from the impossible and keep fighting on it, do everything it takes, and in the end, God will help you. And once you achieve your promise, in the end, your real result, you improve as well. So that's the way Mr. Inamori kept on continue to take up the big projects in this way. So this is how he judged his future ability to achieve the result. And up next, we're going to talk about working hard is the land of the clan from ordinary to extraordinary. One of the top geneticists in the world, Professor Kazuo Murakami from the University of Chukuba explains about the extraordinary power at the fire scenes, why we can have this extraordinary power. And he say we can achieve this under the extreme condition. But why does this function is in the sleeping mode at the normal condition? He say because this function is in the off mode. And once you turn it on, then you can unleash your power during the normal condition. So we can see how important it is that once you turn this on, your positive energy, your positive thinking, your action and everything, you can turn it on and you can unleash your power, unlimited. So all this is already proven at the genetic level. So by the way, let us all talk about this. Have you ever thought about how big is the thing that human could possibly achieve. In human's mind, we'd always want things to happen in this way, in that way, my way, your way. So if you look at this from the genetic perspective, everything is doable. Everything is achievable. So in short, we human, we have this ability to turn our dream to become reality. Well, setting up a big goal is important. To make this happen, we still have to make it step by step and working hard and all this, they are a must in this process. During Kyocera was a small factory in the village, Mr. Inamorin always told his employee who were not satisfied with the company and he say this company is going to be the world class company. Although today it seems like pretty far from the target, but in my heart, Mr. Inamorin he say I have a strong desire to make this happen and I want to prove it to everyone. No matter how big is your goal, how beautiful is your vision, you still have to do the same thing every day. And to continue yesterday's job, well, you have to wipe off your sweat and continue to grow step by step, piece by piece, and to solve every single problem in front of you. So this is part of the progress. And he asks, if I continue to do the same thing, when am I going to achieve the world class, the so-called world class company? And Mr. Inamori was hit by the fact that the huge difference between the dreams and the reality. And you see, this is life. Well, life is all about the accumulation of every day and your current moment. If you get all the current moment, they become a day. If you get all the days, they become a week, a month, a year. This is the process. So when you realize the time passes and you become better, little by little, you are already on top of the mountain. This is what exactly happened to Mr. Inamori. Well, even your goal is just short term, but you still have to finish your task today. If you don't, tomorrow it won't come. To reach your destination, there's no shortcut. No matter how far is your goal, still you have to start your first step, step by step, piece by piece eventually you're gonna make it. So we have to be serious on our goal. We have to strive hard, work hard every day. So if you finish the things that you're supposed to do today, you will see a better tomorrow. So the same things, if you work hard tomorrow, you will see a better next week and next month. So we have to consider all this. Consider to put your full efforts on every single movement. So you will see a better future that previously it may seem like blurry, uh, impossible. And Mr. Inamore, he said he is like a tortoise, walking step by step, piece by piece, without realizing his company is getting stronger little by little. So this is the result he achieved today. His advice to people, instead of 
worrying about tomorrow, planning so hard for the future. Why don't you just focus on today? Do your best, put your best efforts for today. So this is the only way to achieve your goal, to turn the dream to become reality. So that's the sharing for this video. If you find values and learn something from this video, you gotta smash the subscribe button and turn on all the notifications so that you're not gonna miss out any video just like this from this channel. And most importantly, leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. I would love to read the comment and reply to your comment. And I hope to see you in the next video.